On November 12, 2024, NATO's Allied Rapid Reaction Corps announced that Finnish artillery units, Mavoimat, had joined forces with a multinational artillery brigade, MNFAB, for the dynamic front exercise. This multinational training event, held in Finland's Arctic forests and other European regions, brings together forces from NATO member countries and invited partners, showcasing the alliance's commitment to enhancing interoperability across diverse and extreme environments. The Multinational Artillery Brigade, MNFAB, operates as a flexible, ad hoc unit composed of artillery subunits from various NATO nations. Unlike traditional brigades, it can mobilize different national contingents for specific exercises or crises, enhancing NATO's ability to respond to emerging threats. This exercise emphasizes the cooperation between forces equipped with diverse artillery systems and specialized capabilities, highlighting the importance of collective defense within NATO. Finland, a recent NATO member, is at the heart of this exercise, providing K-9 Thunder self-propelled howitzers to strengthen the firepower and operational flexibility of the multinational force. Finnish Mavoimat units, crucial to Finland's land defense, are joined by French artillery forces, including the 93rd Mountain Artillery Regiment, CDC 93E Ram, who deployed their Caesar artillery systems, 155mm truck-mounted guns known for their precision and mobility. The U.S. Army also plays a leading role in the exercise through its 56th Artillery Command, integrating forces and demonstrating the power of advanced systems like the HIMARS multiple launch rocket systems and M777 howitzers. While Switzerland is not a NATO member, it participates as an observer, sending six Swiss military personnel invited by France. Switzerland's involvement highlights its commitment to international military cooperation while maintaining a neutral stance. Though Switzerland has not deployed combat equipment, it operates M109 self-propelled howitzers, which have been modernized to fit the country's mountainous terrain. The dynamic front exercise, running from November 4 to November 24, 2024, spans Finland, Estonia, Germany, Poland and Romania involving over 1,800 U.S. troops and 3,700 Allied forces from 28 countries. This exercise is a key part of NATO's efforts to enhance the interoperability of its forces, ensuring rapid and effective coordination across a vast geographic area. The training includes live-fire drills and logistical support missions, helping Allied units refine tactics and improve operational readiness. One of the key challenges NATO faces is the diversity of military equipment across member nations. Different communication systems, artillery calibers, and maintenance protocols can complicate joint operations. However, exercises like Dynamic Front are essential for overcoming these hurdles. By fostering interoperability through shared training and standardized procedures, NATO forces can optimize coordination despite differences in equipment, ensuring greater effectiveness in future operations. Dynamic Front 2024 highlights NATO's ongoing commitment to collective defense and operational cohesion. As the alliance adapts to the evolving security landscape, exercises like this are vital for strengthening the bonds between NATO members and partners, improving the readiness of all forces involved. In a world where rapid response and flexibility are key, NATO's ability to operate as a unified force has never been more important.